language. When I was in ninth grade, they taught us a technical word for sexual intercourse. It's coitus. Did you know that? Coitus, that don't sound like what we do, does it? <laughs> coitus, how do you work that into your daily conversation? Yo, man, why don't you take them Laker tickets and give them away, because I'm going to go to Renee's house tonight and see if I can get that coitus. You know? <laughs> what the fuck is coitus? You know, coitus sounds like something that grandma might get. It you know, like in her hands or some shit. It's like, you know your grandma got the coitus, right? Some shit like arthritis or something. Yeah, she got the coitus. She don't bowl no more. You know, she, hands all fucked up with the coitus. It, it, it don't sound like sex. You know. Janet Jackson used the word in the movie, punani. That sound more like what we do, punani, yeah. yeah. And it's such a happy word. You can't even be mad and say punani. <laughs> Try it. You, if you're mad and say punani, it'll make you glad. It's something about the word in your mouth, you know? Come home from work after a long day and look in the mirror and say, punani. It just, it just makes you happy. Make you smile. Read in the paper that there's an element of Viagra that athletes are taking out to enhance their performance. I think that's funny. They ain't gonna need a test to find out who these motherfuckers are. <laughs> At some point, the four by four relay team gonna be fighting out there because the motherfuckers like, hey, nigga, that wasn't no baton, that was your dick, motherfucker. I'm, uh -uh, no, you gotta stop taking that shit. Stuck a dick in my hand. No, fuck this race, man. You stick a dick in my hand again, I'm gonna whip your ass. Viagra. 